Warning, please do not attempt to recreate any of the stunts performed in this show for the safety of yourself and others around you. The following stunts performed by professionals or under the supervision of professionals. Are you sh sure about that? I don't know, let's just play the video. <laughs> So we've made it, day four of Cable Carnival. It's been absolutely crazy so far to see the boys throwing down so hard. And I'm actually surprised most of them have made it this far. Yeah, is that Alfie still riding? Yeah, I, I don't know how they're still how going. How is he doing that? I know. But anyways, we have got one last surprise challenge in store for the boys today. It's gonna to be an insane one. All right, boys, we have made it to the final day. Thank God you're all still alive. I'm hurting, Liam's hurting, and we're pretty sure that you are too. But Liam, what have we got for today's challenge? So today we are gonna be doing the double length line air trick. Whoever can throw down the best air trick on the double length line is gonna take the win. Hey, I'm figuring out the old Eskimo, but I'm all We're also gonna be trying to tick off the rest of the miscellaneous challenges. We know there's a few funny ones left on there, so if you guys want to smash through those, that would be awesome as well. Before you ask, yes, the double length line does work. I tried it out a few days ago and uh, you just need to go pretty wide on the corners. Air tricks, however, are not so fun. Hoping to see what you guys put down. It's going to be a super fun day. Yeah, thank you guys all for the last three days. Glad everyone's made it to this final day. It's going to be a sick one, so get your wetsuits on and we'll see you on the dock. <laughs> <laughs> Kane, you get the Vaseline out alright then, son. Oh, I will be taking part in a lot of them, but I'm not going to tell you because I'm going to do it surprisingly. But I will be doing a lot. And you will be. Oh, oh, Fucking hell! Gotta fucking swim. <laughs> Now, it's indie line and double length line air track. To sum up Cable Carnival this year, it has been hilarious, super scary, adrenaline has been pumping through all the time from all the crazy stuff. You don't know what you're gonna wake up and do the next day, you know? So, it's been crazy. So, so far it's been a crazy few days. I could not have imagined all the things we got done and how insane it's been. I knew it was always gonna be a crazy one, but what we and the boys have got done over here has been insane and just the most fun for four days. We've just been out here with the boys filming, smashing out the challenges and getting some sick riding. Hopefully this is the first Cable Carnival and the first of many more to come. Cable Carnival 2020, it's been a real one. Oh, yeah. I'm buzzing! I haven't done this since I was 11 years old. Yeah, so the Cable Carnival to me is probably one of the most fun 
energetic competitions. I'm happy to be invited to it for the first year. I'm, I'm sure every year it's going to get bigger and bigger, probably more sponsors involved, etc. But the Peacock Brothers have done an amazing job. Hopefully, I'll be joining you boys next time. I'm going to start with toe side and just spin. Yeah. Just split out the whip and just huck. Right. See where I go. Hopefully, I end up in Nando's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no. I'm going to the kicker. So it's fun. Short life, that, like that. It's unreal. So easy when it's like that. That's Nick's first day, mate. I'm hurting. These four days have broken me. Trip now, hopefully, it don't get fucking destroyed like every other challenge. <laughs> 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 The weight games or something. So it's like it's like I'm at the Olympics, I'm knackered by like the fifth event. But mate, double length line is weird as. Fuck. Yeah, the miscellaneous menu. We put together some challenges for the boys before the event, and we didn't even know if they were going to do them or not. I kind of thought it was going to be one of those things where everyone laughs at and but doesn't do them. But the boys seriously stepped up. We ticked off a fair few of those. What's up boys? Ryan and Liam here. We're going to be the first to complete any of these challenges over the four days to earn ourselves some extra carnival cash. Video evidence is needed for the awards to be redeemed. Best tower dive. Off the top. Yeah. Is it actually diving or is it like, just like flips and that? Yeah, just drop this. 
the hall. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, Alfie. <laughs> yes, boy. Nah. <laughs> Alfie, I gotta give that kid respect. He's been sending all of the challengers, did the front two and a half to head dive earlier, butt naked off the tower. You realise the consequences of that? <laughs> 10 metre naked two and a half dive. Best tower dive. I reckon I took that with the double and a half naked this morning. That was scary. Best trick in a bikini. I think Kieran says he's got it, but I think a few of the boys want to ride in that one. Kieran wants to try SMO5 in the bikini, <laughs> but I've told him I'm going to get there first. Made a deal with Lydia that if she crashed, if she got to first, I would do the double flip in the bikini. So fingers crossed, go out, bikini on, bust out the double, take the wing. Sesh just got the boys hyped. Look at this. It's in the air. I still really want to see you land something. I actually don't think it's possible. I think your feet just slide out. I think it is possible. Kieran, Bel Air. I, I don't know. I, I think like a Bel Air would work because you'd use your toes and then your toes will keep it. Mm. Bel Air could uh, be. Bel Air don't count. That's a witch. Mate, you try it and then tell me it don't count. <laughs> 